Since so-called nerd culture is uh, becoming more and more mainstream, it's no surprise that we are uh, seeing this in professional wrestling as well. From Stardust having supervillain-style feuds with the Green Arrow to Xavier Woods playing the Final Fantasy Victory theme on the trombone, uh, these references are becoming more and more prevalent in professional wrestling. My question to you folks is this week, what nerd realm slash wrestling realm crossover would you love to see next? Oh, wow. I think we got the perfect collection of people for uh-huh. this question this week. <laughs> so I got one. All right, Bobby. I want to see the mountain enter NXT finally and take what is his, the NXT title. Because <laughs> he's been there training. By crushing Finn Balor's head? No, no. I want to see that happen. No, no, no. That wouldn't be cool at all. That'd be... <laughs> That'd be kind of murder. Mojo Riley. (laughs) (laughs) Kill Mojo Riley off of NXT. Um, (laughs) So you do want? Do you want him to be the Mountain? Yeah. 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 Okay. Okay. I I think it'd be cool. Or just like have him. I don't know. Just be there. Just be there. There anyway. Just be around. Come into NXT and be part of our world. Just be like, dude, it's the just mountain. Just be there to look at. Yeah, yeah. Just, <laughs> just be the mountain. Hi. Lift this tree in the corner. With... <laughs> I don't know. Wow. Okay. All right. Who, who has the next one here? Uh, I, and this would never happen because he doesn't interfere with other people's timelines. Um, <laughs> but I want the doctor to come and tell Stardust. Uh, and, and it would be great for uh, to a great way to turn him face um, to just have the doctor show up in the TARDIS and tell him that uh, the path he's on is horrible and like show him what's going to happen to him if he stays heel. I mean, look at you, you're with the Ascension now. Right. Uh, <laughs> I, and, and like I said, it, he would never do it because he doesn't mess with people's timeline, but I would just like the TARDIS to show up randomly on raw. Mm-hmm. Well, wouldn't that be great? Like- Oh, but maybe maybe sometime when they come up when, when they go to Britain because there's already a, there's already a phone booth there. Yeah, I was gonna say right. we'll replace the phone booth. Yeah, right. nothing will replace the car there. No, no, certainly not. <laughs> maybe like Big Show go put somebody through it or something. Tried to, didn't work. No, nope. the car's still there. <laughs> the car's still there. That car lived to tell about it. Wow, wow. <laughs> Over and- tea and crumpets. <laughs> Even do you have a, a, a crossover? See, I'm not a gigantic like nerd and like that kind of. I'm I'm, I'm like the only the only thing I'm a nerd for is really wrestling. Uh, I agree that I think Doctor Who is is a is a realm that I think is untapped by WWE, and I'm shocked that they haven't, you know, done anything in that realm. Um, yeah, I this was a, this really isn't nerdy, but I really would have wished they would have actually done something with the Oculus Rift. When they had it that one time and made it like a thing. I, what do you mean, the Oculus? I think they're yeah, they're looking not, not at Oculus that. Rift. No, or whatever it's called, the one the mirror, the mirror. that Adam Rose yeah. looked into. Yeah. yeah. No, no, it's, he's right. It, it, it was referred to as as the Oculus Rift for a while. Well, whatever. So. Show again shows how much of a nerd I am. Mm-hmm. But, didn't, didn't turn him back into Leo Kruger. But <laughs> but <laughs> that's the, I love the idea of using something like that as a plot device mm-hmm. and just you know you know, make it a reoccurring kind of thing. I like that. There should be a little more technology in wrestling, you're saying. Yeah, definitely. Why not? You that, know? that isn't RoboCop. Other, other, other like, indie promotions like Jafar and stuff like that have, you know, used it to success. Why not, you know, why not do it in WWE? Since we've been, damn it, I unearthed the uh, Ark of the Covenant. Mm. <laughs> I mean, Sorg. come here and look at it. Hey, Sorg. Hmm. How many matches has ICP won in JCW because of the Magic Blunt? That is true. That is true. That is true. Uh, that is a plot device on that thing. So I, I mean, I, I'm not saying that WWE should do it, but I mean, it is the hip thing to do. Mm-hmm, mm-hmm. All right, I think I got one. I, it is a little outside the box here, a little bit. Um, so we all know there's a Ghostbusters sh- a movie coming out soon, right? Yes. And I know it's not whatever you think about the casting and everything, but still, it's the Ghostbusters. Damn it. Okay, so it counts. So well, maybe they're doing one of the celeb things, and we—I uh, uh, don't think you do this with Undertaker necessarily. Maybe if this was ten years ago, you do it with Undertaker. Uh, but maybe, maybe we also have some guest cameos by the Boogeyman. 
hell, let's bring back Papa Shango for the night, okay? And then right. um, we have this, like, threading plot that's almost Scooby-Doo-like in the long run, but, but it's with the Ghostbuster girls, or maybe they actually get Dan Aykroyd or something on wrestling. Or maybe, maybe Dan Aykroyd's a big wrestling fan and we're not aware of it. Um, I, I can only hope, right? Uh, and, 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 and you just have, like, this, this, these weird cameos by everything supernatural that's ever happened in wrestling. What else is there? Can we get some Kevin Sullivan Dungeon of Doom action while we're at it? Um, and then just, like, Big Show walks into all the, like, the booty man and everything, or, or whatever the heck he was called before he was the booty man. It's Zodiac. Not hot. Zodiac. The water's not hot. <laughs> the water's not, it's not hot. hot. There's no Hulkamaniac here. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Just like weird references like that. And just like in, in, or, intertwine some, some of that stuff. Ah, it's not hot. hot. The, only, the only way I will accept that is if uh, there's a lightning fight. <laughs> that leads to that leads to the shock master falling through another wall. WCW uh, almost had a crossover with Mortal Kombat when they tried like Glacier and Mortis and Wrath and all them. And why they, are we they, not? Why have we not brought up in the last like fifteen or some years that Kane can control lightning? Because that's a thing, guys. Right. Yeah. How 